I'm Ted C. Jones, Chief Economist for Stuart Tyler. And here we are, which is typically the peak of the selling season, kind of heads downhill after that. But things are happening that may change that. May, U.S. existing home sales numbers, the National Association of Realtors, we hit 5.53 million on a seasonally adjusted annualized basis. That's up 4.5% year over year. But really, the statistic you want to hear is the sales in May were the best they've been since February 2007. And if you look at median price, it hit an all-time high, $228,900, up 4.7% year over year. That makes 51 consecutive months of increases in year over year values in U.S. homes. Oh, and you think, oh my goodness, we're going to take a hit on affordability. But we just had a global event that's changing all that. Y'all have heard of the Brexit, when the United Kingdom literally voted just a couple weeks ago to leave the European Union. And what's happening, because the uncertainty there is, European investors are coming over and buying U.S. Treasuries. As a result, the 30-year residential mortgage rates are within a hair of being the lowest they've been in history, and probably will sink well below that. Freddie Mac, the real keeper of interest rates, reported as of Tuesday this week, second week in, in July, 30-year fixed rate loans averaged 3.41%. The lowest in history was 3.31% in February 2012. This flight to quality of these European investors coming over and buying 10-year treasuries saw that the U.S. Treasury this week closed at the lowest it's ever done, 1.367%. So what does that mean to you all that are contemplating either refinancing your home or buying a home? If history follows suit, and if rates stay where they're at, the 30-year residential mortgage rate sometime in the next month to two months will be down between 3.1% and 3.3% all-time lows. So I want to talk to y'all, homeowners, great time to refi or exit. If you want to refi, not only refinance, but considering getting a 15-year mortgage loan, you may have 20 or 25 or 26 years left, pay it off that much quicker. Secondly, if you're a homeowner and you're looking to exit, we've had an affordability issue with home buyers coming in. This reduction in interest rates all of a sudden makes housing that much more affordable. And if you're that prospective buyer, this may be the opportunity of a lifetime to literally get a 30-year fixed rate loan at the lowest rate we may ever see in our lifetimes. And by the way, it's just one-tenth of 1% away from that. So how do you find out what to do on this? Well, lenders always know the realtor. Your realtor knows who the active lenders are in town. If you want to sell, call your realtor. They know the market. If you want to buy, get that realtor online real quick because I can show you the properties. Ladies and gentlemen, opportunity of a lifetime. I'm Ted C. Jones, Chief Economist for Stuart Title.